What's going on guys, it's Quixel from the Quixel Media here and today we will be taking a look at Power of the Primes. Now, this is not reveals, this is going to be a top 5 list of my most awaited figures of this line. As far as we know from now, no leaks in this list, only the figures that we know uh, will come and we know that have like final product images those will be the only figures included so without further ado i think let's just get into the list so number five is going to be a pretty small dude but definitely one of my favorites it's legends class beachcomber yeah that's right beachcomber i love this character and i can't explain why but i think he's just an awesome character and um I remember one of my first Transformers figures being a Universe Legends class Beachcomber. So this upgrade, side being totally awesome, does uh, bring back some very good memories from back in the day. So yeah, overall, I just, I just really like this figure. Very impressed with it. So I I hope I can get him. So yeah, let's just move on to the number four spot on the list, who is a lot bigger. And he is no other than Rodimus Unicronus, who for some reason I couldn't find any official pictures for. If you would leave it down in the comments what is the reason for that, I would very much appreciate it. But, this figure is, um, some, it's, it's like, I, uh, I like the Rodimus Prime mold, but I don't, uh, exactly, uh, like the Rodimus Prime figure because I don't think there is much changes happening in the evolution from Hot Rod to Rodimus Prime. While here, he goes um, through a lot of changes when going from Hot Rod to Rodimus Unicronus. The head sculpt is very much different and I like that a little bit more. Kind of looks like a cop, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why, but it just... I just think of a cop when I look at that head sculpt, and overall, I just think the paint is awesome. The the purple and uh, and and the black just really mash together, and I think this is an awesome figure. But definitely not my favorite leader class figure, to be exact. Now, the the third spot on the list is actually a smaller figure, but not that small. It's Voyager class Grimlock. Yes, 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 Grimlock. I did hate on this figure a little bit, but then uh, I watched a lot of videos um, about it, and I did kind of fell in, uh, fall in love with it. I just, I just kind of fall, fell in love with the, with the whole design, the whole figure, the proportions, everything. So. Now it kind of went from being a meh to a must buy, so yeah, cannot wait for it to release in Europe, hopefully that happens sooner or later, cause I am hungry for Power of the Primes, and you know, if Power of the Primes comes out, you know what that means, it means toy hunting time, but that's, that's for later, that's for later, so our next pick is uh, none other than uh, another Dinobot, and uh, she is smaller, and uh, it's possibly my favorite Legends class figure of all time. Now, that's a very bold statement, but I really do think this is one of my favorite Legends class figures of all time. It is none other than Legends class Slash, yes. Slash, so, a new Dinobot character, which I am always open for, and I, I just love pocket-sized Dinobots, and I love the Raptor mode, I think it looks awesome. The transformation is simple, but enjoyable, as it looks like, uh, because I, of course, don't have it at the time of this recording, uh, but the transformation looks like it's fun, it's enjoyable. So, so I really hope uh, it is in person. And judging by the videos I saw, this uh, 
guy or girl uh, does have a lot of good pay naps, so I'm very happy with that. So kind of, uh, kind of a, uh, kind of just an awesome new Dinobot. So yeah, I'm just, I'm just really happy that uh, that he got released. Uh, so yeah, let's just move on to the second one, to the to the first pick of mine, who is uh, none other than Leader Class Optimus Prime. Yes, this is, I think, the perfect Optimus Prime to begin with. You know, Voyager Class Orion Pax, he goes to being a ginormous Optimus Prime, and that Optimus Prime holds the truck and the trailer inside of him so I think he's just very cool and he's going to be the must buy for me but who is going to be the must buy for you guys let me know in the comments down below and I'm very interested to hear your thoughts so as always I was Craig Switch asking you to like, comment and subscribe and see you on the other side PEACE